Our application lets you draw uh, a path onto the screen, like so, mm -hmm. which can then be remotely sent to the car for the uh, car to follow. When the car sees an obstacle, it will alert the application and highlight where on the screen the obstacle was so it can be dealt with. At which point you'll be able to switch onto a manual mode where you have a traditional joystick which allows you to manually control the car's movement. This will allow you to go around an obstacle uh, and deal, other ways deal with it. Where do you think it could be used? Uh, it has applications in storage facilities where you have large areas where you're having to have robots move uh, move uh, objects from one side of the facility to the other. It can also be used in areas where the um, it's not safe for humans to be around, like bomb disposal and that sort of thing. And the having two modes of um, getting it to go where you want it to go allows it to be very usable in different situations. Yeah. Can you run this? So you did find an obstacle over there. Yes. Thanks. So currently the press connect. So the Bluetooth connects to the card and then I'll show you a message when it's finished. Any time now. There we go. Yes. Connection. And then you draw a line on the screen. And no matter where you start the line from, it's always going to see from the perspective of the car. So even if it's a diagonal line, this is just going to move her forward a little bit. Okay. So you can press send, and then I'll do that. Ah. So you can do uh, like turns and whatever, and it'll, it'll uh, like try, try however you want. Oh, it, it'll automatically refresh when okay. you touch the screen. Yeah. And uh, yeah, you press send again. Yeah.